All right, boys, so a little bit of an update. Uh, I haven't posted on my YouTube channel what I actually got. So that's nice. Okay, that's the autism boy. Um, we have two new birds. We finally have a blue one. I fucking, yeah, there we go. We finally have a blue one. They're sleeping right now. And a green one. They're both female. Or I'm guessing they're both female. So yeah, um, we put them here because... The mom was stabbing them, so I can guess they're both female. Um, we have still these guys, and these are the freaking mom right there. Alright, um, we have the hamsters right here. We I haven't cleaned their cage, I still have to do that. Um, this is Ham, this is Ham, Ramirez, Hamilton, I don't know. No, that's not Captain Nibbles. Oh yeah, this, I think this is, is this Captain Nibbles? I don't know. They, he came up with the name. I don't, I'm not sure. So I'm going to now inform you on what I got. And this is basically what it is right now. As you can see, I have the UVB on. And it looks like green. But it's actually just like normal light. He's in there. Let me just... Oh, you can actually see him right there. You might be guessing what he is. Um, I'll be, let me just turn on the thing. Alright, so I turned it on, and there he is. There's my little, um... Oh, this actually might hurt him, so I'm not trying to do anything to him right now. But yeah, it's my, um, leopard gecko. I'm gonna turn this off now. Okay, so yeah, this is Hamilton. Hamilton. Oh, you little Hamilton. Come on, get on. Come on. Come on, Hamilton. So this is a dwarf hamster. This is pretty nice. Dwarf hamsters don't do anything but nibble on you and climb on you eventually. Get on my hand. No, not on my. No, get on my hand, not on my wrist. Wait. Okay, so it doesn't. Come on, get on my hand. I'm gonna pick you up then. Come on, get on. Uh, Alright, hold on. Get on. Get on. <laughs> Stop running from me! No, there's no escape. Alright, so I got Hamilton. He's not, he doesn't bite. Usually he doesn't bite. Let's see? Um, yeah, so he can drop upside down. Uh, yeah, so he usually won't bite you. Oh, shoot! Okay, never mind, he's on me. He's on you? He's on me! Alright, so yeah, he won't do anything. Uh, basically, this is my leopard gecko, and he's in there. I can't see him because he hide, he hid. He, I can sort of see him. You just can't. So he hid because of the thing. I have to clean this cage as he pooped all over it, and he, he starting to warm up. He hasn't come out in a while because he's starting to get used to it. So he hasn't come out for a bit. Then I started actually like trying to force feed him. By that, I don't mean like shoving things down his throat. I mean like. Putting um, mealworms next to him and like wiggling them around it, and it works. It sort of worked. Like he actually started coming out. I just after I saw that he poked his head, I left the worm there. I leave the worm like in front of his thing or in front of him, and he will eat it. So that's how I forced him to eat. He still eats and he comes up here like sometimes eventually, like at night time. He moves. He comes up here and I turn. And I turn this on, and just, I turn that on, and I turn this off, the UVB. and basically, yeah, that's it, that's basically an update, I'll update you guys later, but if you guys really like, uh, want a fast update, I suggest you go follow me on Instagram, link will not be on this, in the description below, because I'm too lazy, yeah, okay, you know what, I'm gonna try it this time, so, okay, bye, devil.